that she might regain the blessing of light I had foreseen. But she has grown so strong in it as to deny us our power. Let us withdraw, Lahabrea. That power remains to us, at least. So, you harness the eye's power. A pity you spent it all. What will you do now, hero? So, not even the vaunted warrior of light can unmake an Asian without relying upon mortal contrivances. In the distant past, King Thorden and his knights twelve fought and defeated Nidhogg. Though the victory cost them dear, they were rewarded with a great prize, the Dread Worm's Eyes, both of which have since been held in the Holy See's safekeeping. The eye you possess was Nidhogg's left and long has it served as the source of the Azure Dragoon's might. As for its twin, it has lain here joins to the person of Haldreth, the first Azure Dragoon. For though he learned to harness its power, he was ultimately consumed by it. Even in death, his body decays not. A pitiful end for a fabled hero. My Asian friend, long have you and your kind sown the seeds of chaos by teaching mortals the secrets of summoning. But if you assumed that we would meekly serve as your pawn, then you are gravely mistaken. You would raise a hand against us. By taking unto my flesh the soul of the legendary King Gordon, I can become a god. Cessation, whose being is sustained by a millennium of fervent prayer 
and the eyes nigh bottomless reservoir of ether. What? Your contempt for man has proven your undoing, Asian. For my first act as God King, I do hereby sentence you to die! Shall answer you with my blade. 